Cyrax. Cyrax. Yep. Now this is going to be a little bit better for Trophy Club because uh, Kong Lao can't get in as easily, even though he has a teleport. It's a lot slower than Raiden's. And uh, looks like, are they entering the no blood code? Is that what that one is? Yeah, it is. No yeah. blood. Makes the post fight faster. Because <laughs> <laughs> then you don't have the fatalities, and so it just ends the fight right away. Now these two have probably played each other a lot, so they're going to know each other's rhythm pretty well. Oh wow, trade, is he... Oh, no, he out. didn't quite recover in time. And once again, Kong Lao's spin is more punishable in this version than after some of the patches. So after you block oh, it, it's nice much easier to dash up and punish it. Oh, he knew, he knew that step ahead, wow, good stuff. Nice. It looked like Trophy Club went for some reset, but didn't quite get it. And Ruin corners himself. This is going to be a problem. Oh, nice. Resets. This is the highest breaker I've ever seen. <laughs> this is the tip of the ceiling. Oh, and that Kung oh. Lao, that little chain that he did right there, does so much chip damage. The one where he does that. You can't, inter you can't interrupt, huh? Yeah. You're just stuck there. Oh. Yeah, I heard that does like 10% chip damage or something ridiculous like that. All right, here we go. Once again, no breakers for Ruin. So how is he going to get out of this? All right. No resets, though, so he didn't take any extra damage. Nice! Catching that wake-up move with the dive kick. Like I said, the bad thing about that overhead is you end up a screen away. Does he stick that hat into his chest? Yes, he wow. does. Wow. <laughs> He's chilling there, right? <laughs> Let's take his sombrero. All right. And Ruin takes... One takes the first game. He is up one to zero. Goro is not amused either. <laughs> 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 Nobody's amused. He's amused. I don't think that guy hanging on the wall is amused either. So. Oh, wait, he's dead. Uh, he's dead. Oh, wow, that anti-air from Cyrax is really good recovery. Not in time, just a little too slow. Nice, once again, knowing he's going to go for that teleport, catching it with the anti-air right away. Yeah, using that breaker to get out of that situation. Caught the roll before he could actually That's get to hurt. Oh, oh. Once again, no resets in there, but a good 37% damage combo. Oh, and Ruin with a huge opportunity, but drops it there. Great the throw break. tech. So hard to punish that. And this should be it, unless he decides to breaker it. He's tr oh, oh, nice. He went for the throw instead because he can't combo breaker that. Right. All right, both of them trying to stay out of that corner situation. Hmm. Now ruin. I mean, to combo a jump attack into a ground attack in this game. Oh, good. Have, good answer. You actually have to hit the button while you're still in the air. So when Ruin landed that jump punch, he waited too long to hit punch, and that's why he couldn't combo it after he landed. Oh, great block there from oh, Ruin. Oh, good. Good anticipated crouching uh, uppercut. Oh, wow, he's just uppercutting him all over the place. And there's the traps he's got. Throw out the bomb and then the net to catch him out of the air. Teleport using the EX one. Oh, again, there again. He's on point. Nice little counter low punch there from Icy Trophy Club. Break Ruin's momentum. Oh! And Ruin just went for chip in that situation. Round three. Fight! Oh, oh wow. Good. <laughs> I've never seen that before. That's awesome. He's like, I don't care about uh, your They got tricks. Combo breaking doesn't want to go into a huge deficit, especially in round yeah, three. He's not clear for takeoff. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I guess Cyrax is the protector of the nether of the <laughs> of the underworld <laughs> skies. <laughs> oh. oh, dropping combos, giving Ruin a huge opportunity. Nice ex teleport. Here we go. Combo up. Looks like a Tekken combo. Nice. 
nice sequence there. Using that low hat. That low hat is so good. Safe on block and keeps Kung Lao in. Oh, oh resets. So you got you got a little hype little guy over there. <laughs> you got a hype cage monster. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think Blaz Blue has the hype dog. I guess that's the hype monster. The or hype something. monster. Yep. Goro's pet. All right. So they're going right back into it. No blood. Oh, are we all tied up here? Yep. One, right? One, one, one. We're all tied up. Once again, this is three out of five. So they need to win three games. Ruin right now. Just keeping oh. that pressure going. It's looking real solid. So even though that low hat is safe on block, if the opponent throws out that low punch, he can usually uh, interrupt whatever Kung Lao tries next. Yep, just like that. <laughs> All right. Now, Trophy Club, you can see him. He's not throwing out the bombs. Like, a lot of uh, Cyrax players will start throwing bombs to start the opponent doing stuff. But he knows that uh, Ruin's oh, probably waiting for the teleport. Ooh! little punish combo there from Ruin. Takes round one. This is a crucial game three right now. Whoever takes this up will be one game away from advancing to face Justin Wong in the grand finals. Wow, nice counter dive kick. Chasing down the back dash with his dive kick. Ruin right now playing a very smart game. He's been, he's kind of reading Trophy Club's rhythm. Was able to block a lot of the random nets and stuff coming out. You see right there, Ruin playing good defense. Couldn't quite get there. Ooh. Such a good sequence. That little four punch, I think it's one, two, one, two, and then, oh, I think it's one, two, one, one, and then into down oh. kick into hat, into low hat. Oh, so skies are protected. <laughs> Oh, going for that chip. Nice EX teleport oh. to get out of there. But one quick dive kick, and he's right back in, takes the fight. And now Ruin is one game away from advancing to grand finals against Justin Wong. All right. So this is uh, for Trophy Club's tournament life. If he loses this, he will take third place, which is definitely an impressive showing. Ooh. Nice breaker there. Like I said, huge advantage of getting that first hit. Oh, the skies are protected. Yeah, he's so good at catching those Kung Lao teleports with that anti air. There we go. What sequence have we got? Oh, oh, great reset. Oh, he missed it. Oh, crucial drop there. Oh, there it is again. He's so, he's so on point with those that anti-air reaction. It looks like Ruin is going to save his meter. He thinks this round is pretty much lost. So he's not going to combo break anything. He's going to try to do a comeback the old-fashioned way. Nice teleport to escape. Oh, oh <laughs> Protected. <laughs> Dude, anticipated that jump. He can't get hit out of that, can he? No, yeah, no air-to-air -air move can hit him out of that, can he? I'm not sure. I seem to have a really good priority. Oh. And it, and it serves as a wake-up, too. You can't hit him. Well, you try, if he's getting up right. and he does that, you can't hit him throughout the entire enemy. Right, because I mean, when you do the wake-up moves, I, I forget how many frames, but you get like three or four frames of invincibility, I think. I, I don't know the exact number, but you definitely get invincibility, which is why so many of those reset combos that Cabal and Johnny Cage have are so important because you don't knock them down, so you don't give them the opportunity to use those wake-up moves with invincibility. Oh. oh! Once again. Oh, and Ruin once again not comboing that jump into ground attack properly. All right, expect the breaker. Oh, no! Oh, I missed it. Oh, great reset. It actually caught him, and he went oh, for a reset yeah. again. I think you've seen that before. Yeah, yeah. you know, I, I've seen Trophy Club go for that a couple of times now when it looked like the combo was going to finish the opponent off. Ooh. All right, Ruin using the breaker to prevent taking damage. Once again, on round three, you don't want to get that far in a deficit. 
so you're actually better off trying to use your breaker right away. And Ruin has another one. So you know he has to teleport. He's going to land on the bomb. So that's smart from Trophy Club just to be ready for that anti-air. Using the anti-air to get out of there, teleport, punish. Gonna hurt. Oh, resets, and he got it this time. He got it this time. He's gonna have to break. It's coming down to the wire. Nice uh -oh. throw. Oh! oh. Now, we're, now we're really tied up. <laughs> and Trophy Club takes it. This is a close one here, folks. Who's gonna be the king of? Insert coins, <laughs> Mortal Kombat, Las Vegas. Wow, nice little uh, closeout from uh, Trophy Club there. Just not going, nothing for fancy. Fire. Nothing oh, fancy. Oh, there's blood in this one. They didn't put the blood code, so uh, they're, they playing, wanna, they're playing for blood now. Yeah, they're playing for blood because they want a fatality. Oh, each other. damn. All right, here we go. Mix ups time. Nice tech. Ooh, another anticipatory anti air. All right, looks like Trophy Club's got some good momentum going here. with the breaker. Here we go. Once again, huge opportunity. Ruin with no breakers yet. He might as well just take... Oh, great spin to get out of that mix-up. Oh, using the EX teleport. Try to catch him off guard. Maybe bait the anti-air. Didn't work. Nice throw from Ruin. Now, when he went for that throw, uh, Trophy Club might have been expecting him to back throw into the corner, so he didn't take it. Oh, good answer. Oh, here we go. Nice. Oh, he broke his hand off. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> Great throw. I, I said that that one two one one sequence from Kung Lao, really good to follow up with that low kick in the low hat. And that time, Ruin anticipated Trophy Club blocking and so he actually threw him instead. Once again. Yeah, EX teleport. Yeah, EX teleport hits, so it's a good way to get out oh, of situations. Oh and oh, Ruin takes it. Yeah, he's warming up that seat, man. <laughs> he's up, wants that EG just in one. Yep. And now, yep, this is grand finals here at Sin City Heat. Coming to you from Insert Coins in Las Ve downtown Las Vegas, Nevada. And we have EG Justin Wong going against Icy Ruin.